I want to talk about a major problem that a lot of tires have when starting out, and it's creating bulky flies. And you can see as we're getting going on this fly, you can already see a lot of bulk beginning. And you can imagine, you know, as you keep adding stuff, it's going to keep getting bulkier and bulkier. So I'll just touch on that a little bit because it is something that, um, you know, becomes an issue with flies because some flies you don't want to be really um, bulky. You want them to be sparse. So um, there are times when it's okay, but, uh, you know, I really want to let you know. So when you tie some of those smaller patterns, you can, you can kind of bust it out nicely. So the first thing I guess is just controlling the amount of wraps. You can see here, we've already put a bunch of wraps here. And as you get up towards the front, especially towards the, the eye of the hook, when you're doing the, the head, a lot of new tires tend to tie really bulky heads, so that's something to be thinking about. So just try to minimize the wraps. Sometimes all it take, takes to secure material is one wrap or two wraps, um, you know, three wraps, something like that, just to make sure you're secure. So um, that's the first thing. The other thing is just the size of the thread, and I'm using 6 aught thread, but there's a number of different sizes, and, you know, from 8 aught all the way up and higher. You know, the higher the, the aught number, the, the smaller the thread. So... If you're tying very small flies, you'll use a very small diameter. Um, that's pretty straightforward. And when starting out, another good thing is just try to use um, less material than you think. So if, you, if you're grabbing, for this case, some marabou, maybe instead of grabbing you know, a big clump, you start off with about half that. Um, start off with just about half what you think, and that'll keep you um, from getting bulky. And you know, I mentioned the heads is something we'll talk about as we get closer. But I just want to throw that in about the bulk because we're going to be building and tying this little creation here. And I want to make sure you're, you're on the ball and thinking about bulk and just minimizing the total amounts of uh, wraps you do. And I'm, you know, here obviously putting a lot of wraps in because I'm kind of showing, demonstrating this fly as we go. But I would be putting a lot fewer if I was actually tying this. So that's all we have for you on bulk.